It's a beautiful big machine. Produces uh, green wind power, beautiful. The Netherlands, the country known for its craft cheese, tulips, wooden shoes, and windmills. Well, the Dutch don't walk around in wooden shoes anymore, neither do they still use 16th century windmill technology. In the center of the Netherlands, there's a small town called Barneveld, where state of the art high tech wind turbines are developed and produced. The product uh, is a Dutch uh, design, that means uh, simplicity uh, and high quality. Everybody knows, uh, recognizes the simplicity of the product and uh, it gives it a, a, a high value. But I also think that uh, you, you don't have a position in this business unless you have a very cost-effective product. Uh, so for a decent price and uh, also superior quality. And I think what we hear back from our customers in Finland, in the Netherlands, in other countries, uh, is that we have a very good reputation when it comes to availability. Uh, that's over 99%. Uh, and you must do many things right in order to achieve that. Yeah, simplicity is so important uh, because the turbines are running over more than 20 years. And if you think about 20 years of production all the day long, you need a high quality product. And uh, simplicity is then very important for uh, the quality of uh, the energy production itself. It is very difficult to achieve simplicity. I think a very famous French writer said, you know, I wrote you a long letter because I didn't have the time to write you a short letter. Same here, if yeah. you want to uh, make a very simple design, it needs to be very well thought through. And I think, you know, that's where the decades of experience show. Uh, Henk has omitted everything that is not needed. And of course, that drives the reliability. Yeah. Of course, one of the main characteristics of the Lagerweg turbine is the direct drive concept. And in combination with the compact drivetrain, it's a typical Lagerweg product. Uh, typical for the Lagerweg product is a good performance, low weight, and optimized logistic process. Uh, the turbine contains a lot of parts, but the integrated design makes the whole turbine. And it makes it to a success, and that I'm proud of. And although the Netherlands is widely known for its windmills, the Dutch climate is not necessarily where these wind turbines have been designed for. Thanks to some clever engineering, these machines operate in any weather you can throw at them. Well, you can find Lagerweide turbines wherever in the world. I've been driving in Korea and there you saw a Lagerweide turbine on a mountain. And uh, in Alberta, Canada and Alaska you can find everywhere Lagerweide turbines, even in India. Great fields full with Lagerweide turbines. Lagerweide has a very long history uh, of the old generation of turbines based on gearboxes. Uh, over a thousand have been built and many of them are still in operation today. Uh, of our modern technology, the direct drive, um, we're producing now one turbine roughly every two weeks. Uh, so also there uh, for, from this generation a significant number has been built. It's great to be working for an uh, entrepreneurial company. Uh, it's pretty small size but we're growing very rapidly. And so that means that there are many development opportunities for our employees, but we also have the feeling that we uh, build a product that really matters. And we were part of that energy transition. And I think with our technology, we also contribute to a, a better society. So that motivates everybody. One of the many great features of Lagerweide wind turbines is a feature of great simplicity yet magnificent beauty. And we're not talking about aesthetics here. The modular steel tower is a beautiful piece of engineering. It can be built in no more than two weeks, an astonishing feat. The MST tower is a, is a good product because of the simple transportation of the sheets, efficiency in building, and low cost of uh, production. The modular steel tower is a rigid tower assembly made out of pre-bent steel sheets. These 12 meter high sheets are assembled into rings on location. By stacking these rings, towers of up to 160 meters in hub height are possible.
Well, actually, this is one of the major examples that it's an advantage. Uh, you can just offload a frame with MST shells uh, by just using air suspension of the trailer and uh, putting these legs down and then the truck can immediately leave without any support of a crane or whatsoever. And nobody needs to wait, so it's a very simple logistic solution. Every design has its own challenges. The MST tower in special, we have a lot of uh, bolding connections and to get the right uh, pattern uh, of the overlapping of the sheets is very important. The big challenge is to get the right dimensions of the, of the holes of the tower. The modular steel tower of Lagerbay is made of steel. And you could reuse the steel after the use of 25 years. If you compare it to a concrete tower, then it's uh, quite difficult to take it down after 25 years. And the steel tower, you can take it down the same way as you built it, just the other direction. With a concrete tower, you either need dynamite or something nibbling on the concrete to take it completely down without any value at the end of the story. Uh, after this 25 years, steel still has a, a value and concrete most likely will cost money and that's a major advantage of a Lagoi modular steel tower. Engineering and producing one of the world's most high-tech wind turbine systems is one thing, but ensuring a proper build and installation on location is something else entirely. Lagerway believes in offering a carefree total service package where every little detail during the installation of the wind turbines is thought through. We'll do almost everything to get a satisfied customer to realize the project. So we do even arrange finance, but do also wind studies, yield calculations. Uh, we submit drawings. Uh, so we do almost everything to get the project realized. From project realization phase, we start in an early phase together with the account manager to visit the customers and the sites to investigate if it's even possible to get there with these uh, exceptional uh, tower sections and the blades. Next step is that the project manager is responsible for getting all the parts at site, uh, getting the roads constructed, cables laid down, cranes arranged to get the turbine erected. And once it's operational, then it will be transferred to the service department of Lagerwey. The location and orientation of the single unit turbines in a wind farm has a big influence on the energy output. Uh, we have to look at all the uh, conditions in a given location so that we can forecast uh, the conditions for the years to come and place the turbines in a position so that the turbines will in the end not be affected by the wake effects or other losses in the wind farm. We did install turbines in Finland in a project called Mustais Neve, a nine turbine project where we did 12 kilometers road construction, about 12 kilometers cable work, uh, did all the soil investigations and Mustais Neve stands for black swamp, so soil conditions were not always easy. We did a project at the Belgian border called Hazeldonk and there we installed three turbines and created an additional entrance route through a filling station from the motorway directly onto the site. And all these problems were solved and the customer had nothing to do with it because we arranged it all. Uh, in the development phase, uh, Lagerwey helped us uh, uh, to come to a quick and uh, efficient uh, financial close. Uh, and this uh, made really the, the project uh, uh, a success at the startup phase. Yeah, during the construction phase, uh, uh, it all went uh, pretty well, uh, uh, changing of lifting plans, uh, all kinds of uh, coordination with different contractors uh, went uh, very smooth. Uh, the installation itself also went uh, quite smooth and uh, afterwards uh, the wind turbines were quickly commissioned and, uh, and put into operation. There are many uh, considerations uh, when designing a wind farm. Uh, considerations, for example, uh, regarding the uh, site itself, 
uh, the topography of the site, the weather conditions at the site. So uh, based on everything, we then analyze which is the best configuration for that site so that the efficiency is the highest. Uh, yeah, taking in mind all technical, financial, polit political, social uh, aspects that are involved. As Lagari, we are able to help the smaller developer for the turnkey projects as we are experienced and quite often the smaller farmers are inexperienced getting projects realized. So we'll sit at the kitchen table, discuss all outstanding problems and assist them to realize a real project. This is it! Look at the magnificent beauty of four fully operational Lagerway wind turbines. But even though they are truly works of art, we must not forget that wind turbines serve an important purpose – to generate clean, sustainable energy out of an inexhaustible energy source, the wind. And they must do so for decades to come. Using the direct drive principle, a uh, single main bearing and for instance passive cooling, makes the turbine uh, highly reliable uh, because we use quite simple technology to do this. Our direct drive principle means that we do not use a gearbox, uh, so we have less moving parts, which is efficient. Uh, we also uh, apply permanent magnets, and in that way we can build a very compact generator, a very compact machine. We also apply passive cooling on the outside of the generator, in this way, uh, we don't have to build uh, complicated cooling systems. We can just use the wind to cool our generator. The service of Lagerwey uh, is uh, quite uh, accurate and quite uh, fast. So if, if there are uh, any defects on the turbines, uh, they act quickly and uh, solve the problems uh, very quickly. Um, and uh, well, the good thing is until now we didn't have too many defects, uh, fortunately. So also the availability uh, of the wind turbines in the first year up to now is, is really good. It's normal in the market that uh, a minimal lifespan of 20 years is guaranteed. In order to guarantee these 20 years of operation, uh, we have to perform several uh, simulations. Uh, we do this uh, in FE analysis. We also wrote our own code uh, to account for things like fatigue. 20 years is quite a long period uh, for a turbine to survive. But as a team, we succeeded to do this. The Lagerwey monitoring system, they can see from a distance uh, the service me mechanics in the office. They can see what kind of problems there are in the turbine. And there are problems, they uh, can solve it from a distance in 95% of the cases. And otherwise, they can send a mechanic to solve the problem over here. We have a Lagerwey turbine care agreement where we guarantee different percentages, average 97% availability. And the customers can monitor through Lagerwey monitoring system on their computer screen what the availability is. And also with events or when things go wrong, they can see what's going on. And therefore, uh, uh, we show them the availability of the turbines, which is averaged above 99%. This is the Lagerwey monitoring system. The customer can uh, log in on the screen. You can see all the, the energy, the produced energy, uh, the temperatures inside the tower, temperatures in the nacelle, the availability of the turbine. So they have full insight. Uh, they can see what the turbine uh, is doing. Actually, all information, more or less, is available on Lagoi monitoring uh, system. And quite often you see at the smaller farmers, they do have the computer screen next to their TV to show their visitors what the turbine is producing, which is very interesting. What we hear back from our customers in Finland, in the Netherlands, in other countries, uh, is that we have a very good reputation when it comes to availability. And that's over 99%. And you must do many things right in order to achieve that.